everybody, I'm Kimberly Turner from cookingwithkimberly.com and today mom's showing you this beautiful creation that she created. These are pasties, she calls them. She says the English call them pasties. It's a ham pasty. Now we have a, had a, cooked a ham the other day. A beautiful big ham. Yep, make sure you check out that, uh, that show. It was super good. We're still eating on it today and continuing. But these are beautiful. Look how pretty these are. Don't they look like little sunbursts, little patties. Look at this. So these are filled with ham stuff, and this is mom's gorgeous um, pie dough recipe. So yes. tell us, mommy. Yes, I used the uh, pastry from, I made some pies over the weekend for Christmas, and uh, you know, we don't like to waste anything in our house, so I cut up little uh, cubed the ham that was left, some of it, and I mixed it with um, uh, just black pepper and a little bit of maybe a teaspoon of mayonnaise. And cheese. I just put the cheese on separately. So I cut circles out, put the little clump of meat in there, and a little bit of mozzarella cheese on top. And then I made an equal little circle and put it on top and uh, just pressed it together with a fork to keep it uh, closed. Now you use a scallop cutter. Yes, I did. And that's why it looks so pretty like that. Look at that. Aren't they so pretty? <laughs> Aren't they cute? And they're so tasty too. Mm -hmm. And you can dip things, you can use it. They're nice for a little snack yep. or with a little salad or something like that. And around this house, we're big on snacks. Yep. So. And you can reheat that as well. <laughs> yes, you could also You could also eat that like with a green salad or another veggie as a, as a meal. Right. You know what I, mean? I think the next time I make these, it just came into my head the other day and I hadn't made them before. Uh, the next time I think I'll use bigger circles and then fold them in half like a pierogi sort of thing. Like but, a giant, like a like a Jamaican patty almost. Yes, gotcha. Yeah. I, I like that idea. So the spices yeah. you use salt, pepper, and some cayenne probably. Uh, no salt. Oh right, because the, the ham, ham is salty. salty. Mm -hmm. A little cayenne and a lot of black pepper, and one teaspoon, only one teaspoon of mayo, just to spice it up a little bit. So you baked little. it in the oven on a cookie sheet. Yes, for uh, about 15 minutes. On what temperature? Uh, 350. 350. Well, the recipe will be on the site as well, accompanying this video. And these are mom's ham pasties. Mm -hmm. Is that what you want to call them? Yes. Ham and cheese pasties? Yes. Well, there you go. That's They're how you do it. Delicious. And we're so big on, on snacks. Everybody can just grab a little something. And, you know, you don't have to throw out, every, when you don't have the, the end of your ham, you don't have to throw out all those mm. little bits. Just cube them up real fine and put them in a little bit of pie dough and you'd be surprised. Right. Your family will be impressed. And they're good hot <laughs> or cold. Both. That's yes. what I'm saying. They're good mm -hmm. hot and cold and you can reheat them very mm -hmm. simply. Yes. Right? All right, so that's it. Make sure you check out mom's website at ingridturnertoday.com as well. And uh, that's oh, it. I forgot one thing. I just brushed the tops with a little bit of cream mm. so it browns up nicely. With cream? Yes, with cream. You could do with it with milk. carnation milk. Could actually. you do it also with milk, right? Yeah. And you could also put butter on top probably too. You could. But then you have to keep a closer eye probably. Well, I figured there's already enough fat in there. I didn't want to add that. Butter. Extra, yeah, gotcha. But they're nice and flaky and gorgeous. Oh yes. They Anyhow, are. I'll also include the pie dough recipe in the in the recipe on the site, but you can find that separately as well. Mm -hmm. Anyhow, that's it. Make sure you check me out on Twitter at Cooking with Kim E with a capital E. I hope you like the fan page at facebookcom Kimberly. My shows are on ifood.tv Kimberly and youtubecom Kimberly. And the site is cookingwithkimberly.com. <laughs> that's it. That's all. Be a champion in your kitchen and eat deliciously. Bye. Happy New Year. Enjoy. This is our first New Year's video. New Year's show. New Year's show. New Year's show. Bye.